driving innovation and self-reliance. Defence Research and Development Organisation DRDO has positioned India among select few nations with capabilities to design, develop and produce advanced military systems. DRDO developed systems worth more than 1,60,000 crore rupees have been inducted or approved for acquisition by the armed forces. These indigenous weapons, platforms and equipment are supporting Indian armed forces in keeping the nation secure. As the soldier support systems developed by DRDO's life sciences laboratories go a long way in protecting the protectors, taking care of psychological, medical and nutritional needs under harsh diverse environs and the terrain. DRDO as a dynamic organization is committed towards enhancing the capabilities of armed forces through cutting-edge technologies restructured itself to meet the challenges of future with many of its key projects reaching maturity DRDO during recent time has experienced a series of glorious achievements DRDO's promise in strategic systems led the way as Agni 4 entered the induction phase on its way to join Agni 1, Agni 2 and Agni 3 to further strengthen India's strategic might. The repeat copybook launch of Agni 5 and its two missile ejection tests validating canister launch dynamics paved the way for its launch in operational configuration. Production clearance of BO-5 underwater launched missile system was accomplished after a series of successful trial incorporating many novel technologies and proving reliability of the system. Another major breakthrough was the maiden launch of longer range underwater launched ballistic missile K-4 that will further boost India's deterrence capabilities. The onboard nuclear reactor of INS Arihan achieved a criticality in its preparation for submarines seawards trials. India's first long-range cruise missile Nirbhay had its maiden flight proving several critical technologies. In the direction of establishing a credible two-layer ballistic missile defense system, a series of successful interceptions by the Endo-Atmospheric Interceptor AAD demonstrated its reliability. The longer range Expo Atmospheric Interceptor PDV had its maiden flight, proving several critical indigenous technologies. In the arena of tactical systems, productionization and induction of Akash, medium range air defense system with multi target, multi directional capability is another remarkable achievement of a DRDO. Astra the state-of-the-art beyond the visual range air-to-air -air missile capable of engaging targets decisively was integrated with Sukhoi 30 combat aircraft designed to arm MiG-29, Sukhoi 30 and India's own Tejas. Astra has undergone series of successful flight trials. Brahmos supersonic cruise missile designed to be launched from land, air, sea and the subsea platform has become the preferred weapon system. With over 10 Navy ships equipped with the Brahmos, a deadly weapon, an army with the two regiments, its underwater launched version underwent successful trial from a submerged pontoon. Helena, a lock-on before launch, fire and forget, anti-tank guided missile that can be fired in both direct and top attack mode was integrated on advanced light helicopter ALH. The missile with capability to defeat futuristic armors is undergoing field trials. A 4 km long supersonic rail track rocket sledge penta rail test facility became operational. RTRS facilitates the test article to be propelled by specially designed rockets of high supersonic velocities for evaluating wide range of critical systems. A national test facility, RTRS, will accelerate the pace of development of defense and aerospace products and technologies. Tejas, 
India's own lightweight multi-role supersonic. Fourth generation plus contemporary combat aircraft received the initial operational clearance. With production going on, Tejas is heading towards achieving the final operational clearance. LCA Navy, the naval version of Tejas, capable of operating from aircraft carrier ship, is undergoing flight trials. Shore-based test facility simulating the deck of an aircraft carrier was set up and operationalized for testing of LCA Navy and training of pilots. Two indigenous airborne early warning and control systems on Embraer platforms have been realized and are undergoing extensive flight trials in operational configuration. Demonstration of precision air dropping of 16 ton BMP tank with the indigenously developed P-16 heavy drop systems was yet another accomplishment. With the two regiments of Arjun, main battle tank already a proud possession of the Indian Army. Arjun Mark II with over 70 additional features has also entered advanced phase of user trial. Arjun catapult gun a blend of SP-130mm artillery gun and the chases of proven Arjun MBT will give the Indian artillery the much needed punch. Carrier Command post tracked Vehicle CCPT has been developed for tactical fire control functions to facilitate effective deployment of a self-propelled artillery regiment. Reached advanced stage of acceptance. The mantra a tele-operated track system for unmanned missions for the detection and tracking of a wide variety of ground targets under all environmental conditions is undergoing trials. The system is available in surveillance and MBC Reiki configurations aimed at enhancing mobility and reach of land forces. A new modular bridging system capable of yielding single span of up to 46 meters and capable of bearing load up to 70 tons was developed and is undergoing trials. In a significant contribution to boost firepower, rocket launcher Pinaka entered the operational command of the Indian Army. First time in the world, artillery fire thermobaric ammunition capable of delivering a devastating simultaneous fragmentation. Thermal and blast effect has been developed for MBT Arjun to further boost its firepower. Among the naval weapon systems, Varunastra, a heavyweight torpedo, underwent extensive sea trials. DRDO's technological strength in this highly security sensitive and critical area is exemplified by the development, production, and acceptance of WLR an advanced electronically scanned pulse Doppler weapon locating radar, a missile approach warning system and a counter major dispensing system with a unified display unit has been developed for protecting the helicopters. Completion and acceptance of Varuna, a modern ESM system for Navy with capability to intercept and process modern radars is yet another example of DRDO's self-reliance in the field of electronic warfare. A series of secure communication systems based on software-defined radio, ranging from handheld sets to aircraft and ship-based systems has been developed. The compact systems are capable of operating on multiple frequency bands, avoiding need for multiple systems. An indigenous flying test bed, a key test facility for electrical and functional evaluation of airborne payloads has been realized. Acceptance of lightweight integrated multifunction sign for surveillance and speedy engagement of targets and an electro optical fiber control system. Eon 51 for Navy was yet another achievement. Alive to the needs of emerging war scenarios. DRDO has taken up development of unmanned war machines as a major thrust area and has made significant achievements. Daksh, a state-of-the-art remotely operated ground vehicle 
an invaluable asset for bomb disposal was inducted. Series of successful flights of long endurance UAV Rustum 1 in its final configuration has proved its capability. Rustum 2, a medium altitude and long endurance UAV system for the three services in preparation of its flight trials is undergoing runway taxi trials. An advanced autonomous underwater vehicle has been demonstrated as spin-offs for civil sector and social cause. Biodigesters developed for environment-friendly disposal of human excreta in extreme cold regions at high altitudes were adapted for railway coaches and Lakshadweep islands. Ensuring freedom from denial regimes and external controls, the indigenous defense technologies have propelled India to mark its presence among world's only four countries with the multi-level strategic deterrence capability. Five countries with own BMD program, six countries with own main battle tank, seven countries with own fourth generation combat aircraft and indigenous EW and radar systems. With perseverance and excellence, DRDO continues its march towards self-reliance, breaking barriers and reaching out to the new horizon with a mission to see India entering the league of a superpower.